What's up guys? I uh, just want to quick show you how to use a cylinder leakage test um, for the, for this uh, yard machine uh, snow blower. The 5 horsepower Tecumseh is notorious for um, exhaust valve uh, leakage. So what I did before I started filming is um, I pulled it over until I got the top dead center. You know it's at top dead center because you see the intake open with the spark plug out, you know, looking down through the hole. So when the intake valve closes, you'll see the piston come back up to the top. That's when you know you're at top dead center. Um, so then from this side, I'll stick a screwdriver right above the starter gear into the flywheel to uh, lock it in place. So then I will hook up the uh, leakage tester. Um, pretty snug here and then hook up to the air compressor. So now what I'm going to do is open this, let air in, and I'll see uh, my air pressure go up, and then I'll see how much pressure is still in the cylinder here. Um, what I'm looking for is, I usually don't go past 90 because when you get to 100, the um, O-ring starts to, to leak a little bit. So I'll usually go to about 90, and I'll see where I'm at on the uh, how much pressure is built up. And then I'll do a little bit of math. You don't want more than 10 to 15%. So here we go. So I'm just gonna start letting some air in. So as I'm getting closer, I can actually hear the air coming out of, feels like the exhaust, so it doesn't surprise me. I'm gonna go to about 90 and see where we are. So we're right around 61. Uh, pounds there so I know I can hear it and I know that this uh, exhaust valve is leaking like crazy I might even actually get a little bit through the, uh, the intake as well so this is definitely going to need a valve job um, that's about a 30 30 31 32 33 percent loss so it will run it just it's, the symptom is as soon as it hits snow it basically dies so I'm gonna take this top end off. I'm gonna rebuild, uh, sorry, cut the valves down a little bit, reseat them, um, and uh, then we'll check again afterwards. Thanks for watching.